That's a high bridge going over the Chapea River. Man, it must be 70 meters, 80 meters up there. Crazy. And full moon right over there. I've never seen a clock within the temple entrance. There is one at Wat Dan. Rama Free Road. This is the Krung Si head office here on Rama Three Road. Over there is a talent acquisition center. Check distribution center. Mortgage Loan Center. There's the main tower. Huge tower. Big sign out in front here. Crossing the train tracks. I'm almost back. I've flown to a very long walk. Four tracks to cross here. I don't think they're very functional. A little bit farther. I made it to Klung Toy Market and now I'm on bus number 136. Eight Thai Bot. Heading for bus intersection. There's only two people on the bus. Lots of the ticket lady and the driver. Three drinkable water at these water fountains scattered throughout Bangkok. I just filled my bottle up and I'm good to go. Have some more water. This is what soy cowboy looks like in the times that we live in right now. And the bars in Bangkok are closed. Usually this street is packed with people, mostly foreigners. They're even taking the opportunity to do some construction while well, things are quiet here. Putting some pipes into the ground it looks like. Great massage at Tony Thai Massage. A hundred baht for one hour. Bus ride number four for nine and a half Thai baht. Down Sukhumvit Road.
I hope this video gave you an idea of what $10 or 320 Thai baht can get you in Bangkok, Thailand. I actually spent a grand total of $9.78. And I got a coconut shake, beef noodle soup, five bus rides, four non-aircon bus rides and one aircon bus ride, a street side buffet, mango sticky rice, and a Thai massage. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Comment in the comment section below. Subscribe and hit the bell icon so you're notified when I post future videos. See you guys in the next video. Bye bye.